How's it going all you beautiful muggies? It's Muggy here and welcome back to Star Fox Adventures. In the last episode we came down and explored more of uh, Dark Ice Mines and uh, we helped our Willy Mammoth here who helped us get through a couple places and uh, we called him over after we found the horn. So now let's just get her going. Alright so in this section because last time we tried running through the blizzard, we couldn't get through. Now we actually can. To guide the Snowhorn through the blizzard, he will need to be fed Alpine roots as you explore. Look on the ground and walk over them to eat. So you can notice on the ground, you'll see these Alpine roots. And with these, um, you're going to have to collect them as you go. These do help as a way to like see your path. But you really got to collect them. Because if you miss one... Most likely you'll maybe just miss the other, might make it to the one, but otherwise you're going to have to start all over. And that's the last thing you want to do with something that's kind of wasting all this time. I do know if you hook a little bit to the side somewhere, yeah, you can cut like into a shortcut basically. Well, this way is actually quicker. Once you get up here, you can get up to these Alpine routes that leads you to this other tunnel. And uh, that way your time walk through this blizzard is cut in half. Which is great. Any shortcut's a good shortcut. So you just gotta step on through with our woolly mammoth friend and uh, hopefully he's fed and make it through this blizzard. Uh, right after this part, we should get into the actual Dark Ice Mines, the mines themselves. Which was hopefully, uh, which is hopefully we can find the spell some, somewhere nearby. But first we have to find Belinda Tay because she's the only one that knows or possibly knows where the spellstone could be. So let's uh there's our little spot right here. Now we do need to use them Tricky. to break down Tricky Your friend will turn up. Uh, they usually do. Maybe I can help until he does. Oh no! Tricky! Where the fuck is he? God damn it, now we lost Tricky. Well, we gotta use them to break this open. Boom. Alright. Good, now that that's open, we'll get off of him and uh, say our goodbyes to our good old friend. Thank you, sir. You were a great help. God damn it, now we gotta find Tricky. Uh, look at these shark claw dudes. Look at these dudes. Alright, come here. Get fucked. Eat shit. Hiya! And then give him the good old one two. What are you looking at? What you looking at? Ah! Burn him in the fire pit! Ah! Yeah! Ah! No! I'm burning! Fuck! <laughs> Son of a bitch. Alright, let's get some health. And let's try to get down through the mines. But now we have to find Tricky. Ooh, a little rider section. Hell yeah! Sweet. Man, this feels awesome. There's nothing really challenging to go on. All you have to do is just get down there. Oh look, earlier we almost got hit by that fucking boulder. Now that the drawbridge over here that's blocking down to the mines, we can actually get under. Yeah. God, I wonder where the hell Tricky went. He was literally with us, and then he just suddenly disappeared. Oh well, I guess you can't trust good old dinosaurs. Dun bum bum, bucket a bum, bucket a bum. You know, as much as it's boring, there's nothing really to accomplish here. It's kind of fun just having just a nice, simple, just drive down there kind of thing. Man, I sure hope nothing happens. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Ah! Fox, run! Run, you damn it! Go, 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 go! No! Ah, fuck it, just go through, just go through, just go through! Oh, shit, there's a shark claw! Jesus, he scared the shit out of me! <laughs> you motherfucker crept around the corner like I could see you. Ah, just eat shit and die. Ah, I got clubbed in the fucking face. Come on. Ugh! Wait, did you hear that? I thought I heard Tricky for a second. Tricky, where are you? God damn it, where can he be? Hey, little shark claw. Fuck, I'm stuck behind here. No. Get over here, you little fuck! Ow! You didn't charge at me, I didn't charge at you! I just wanted to fight you! Did he come charging at you like a football player? I hear him in the background. Oh, no, they're being enslaved! 
You can't talk to me? I'm sorry, I'll help you out, I promise. I will not leave you there. Tricky! I'm here! Alright, we're gonna have to head over to this pad. And let's try to crawl through here and, uh... Tricky! I'm kinda... Oh, shut up, damn it. We're gonna have to run down here. Uh, boulders will be behind you, so you kinda just wanna hurry the fuck up. But you can always turn around and use your... Invincible shield! Look at that. I'm invincible. My staff is made out of invincible. Alright, let's hit this. Awesome. Clear the fire and get this open. I uh, wonder what's in this little thing. Oh, it's a key. You know what that means. Opening doors. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. This is a shark claw prison key. Cell key. Alright, so now we know it's a cell key. Ah, Jesus! No! Oh, motherfucker try to shoot at me. Alright, let me do some Indiana Jones. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> this is a little Indiana Jones, little tribute. Alright. Not that we got a cell key. Motherfucker. Um, we get down there, and there should be prison cells around the side we can try to get to. To where we can, uh, unlock a door. Hopefully it's tricky. Hopefully it's tricky's door, because we need our little dinosaur friend. Good old buddy chum chum pal, buddy chum pal, buddy friend, little good chum buddy. Ow! I'm on fire! I guess you could say that's a... Firefox. Ah, internet jokes. You don't get it? Okay, I didn't think so. Prison cell. Unlock that. Tricky! Are you okay? Fox! I lost you in the blizzard. Some sharp claws found me and threw me in that stinky cell. Oh, God. How did they find you if you were in the blizzard? Oh, we got lost in the blizzard. Oh, whatever. Okay, hopefully, what's in this cell? It's a mammoth! We gotta help that mammoth! Let's go help out another friend! Oh, jeez, Fox, what are you doing? Ah! Jump that! Show this! Boom! Oh, fuck! Alright, not that we got tricky, I did see something over here that opened. Alright, over here. Tricky, come here! We need you to burn this! Burn! Use flame! Come on, do it! Awesome! Oh god! No! God damn it, you fuck! You didn't let me wait till I get through! Tricky, what did I tell you? How many times do I have to tell you? Stop burning me! Another key! Oh, it's gold this time! Awesome! What do you think about this, Fox? Yeah! <laughs> I'll never get stop with that! Awesome! All oh, diggity dang! You know what? You got something else to say? Oh, same shit! God damn it! No, we already know what you said. God damn it, Tricky. I already heard you the first time. I don't know why I can talk to you again with the same dialogue. It's weird. Oh, maybe, yeah. It's the key for this cell over here. Let's just get... Oh, god damn it. Drop this. Get burned. Open the cell over here. Come on, Fox. Let's help this person out. Chick-ching. Perfect. Hello, are you Banana Tay? Hello. Who are you? I am Fox, and this is the Crown Prince of the Earthwalkers. We've been sent by the Snowhorn Gatekeeper to find the Spellstone. Do you know where it's hidden? My name is Belina Tay. The Gatekeeper is my father. Did he send you to rescue me? Uh, I'm sorry, Belina, but he feels you have betrayed the beliefs of the Gatekeepers. We were only sent to find the Spellstone. The old fool. I had to save the tribe. If it wasn't for my father being a gatekeeper, none of this would have happened in the first place.
Oh, great, I thank God she didn't die. <laughs> and I kind of aimed the camera towards you to look at this hole. Which, at first, when I very first, uh, blah, 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 when I played this game the very first time, I didn't even see that was there, and I felt like an idiot. I was like, where do I go? And it was right in front of me. I was like, god damn it. Alright, we're in these, uh, ice caverns now. I guess they weren't really kidding with dark ice mines. I guess they really meant every single part of it. Ooh, I like how, you know, this place, oh god, cold water. This place reminds me of, um, Zoro's Domain, when it's frozen in Dark of Time. Uh, that's what this place reminds me of. Let me shoot that. Alright, shoot that. Don't break that down. I'm gonna have to shoot this green one over here. It's not really subtle, that you, like, clear that you have to do this, but you kind of have to just figure it out by just being observant. Which isn't bad, but... Because they are different colors, and the only time you'll see it, but... I don't know, I, I can't understand why some people might get fucked over in this spot. Okay. The last down, we drop down there. Oh god, wrong button. Roll. Roll over here and activate the switch. And with this switch, it'll activate these gates. And stock sound effect was playing in the background. Now we got these ice platforms that can help us cross the waterfall. Awesome! Okay. So let's head on back. Tricky's asleep. Tricky, wake up. We got. I got damn it. Tricky, get up. We ain't got time for you to be slipping. We gotta go. Come on. Come on. Come on! Oh jeez. Fuck off. Okay. Boostage up the top! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. This part is a little bit tricky, like the dinosaur. You're gonna have to be really cautious and be very uh, observant to where you're gonna land. Because the last thing you wanna... Fuck off, bitch! Because you wanna make sure you get on the right platforms and make it across to... That cubby over there on the side, a little hole. Um, you're gonna have to time your jumps and make sure you get on the right platforms. Oh, jeez! Okay, this one might make me out to the end. Awesome. No, oh, put this away. Oh, that looks cool. I like the water effect. I always love the water effects in Genki games because they always look um, pretty great for the console it's on. Like Mario Sunshine and so on, so on, so on. Alright, get down here. Push this ice block. No, grab it. And push it. We gotta push it down. Now, this is... I get the idea what they're going from, but this doesn't physically logically makes sense so you push it down and it becomes this giant platform right underneath me <laughs> it becomes this when I'm standing on it's so fucking weird all right let's come up over here and we're gonna head down towards the mines we're going as much as we can awesome heading down okay oh shark claw oh you try to swing at me no I swing at you while I'm on fire hey -ya! get fucked all right Where's the other one? Fight me, you piccadillic whore! Ugh, yeah, get leg swept. Break up, get some. Break up! Gonna throw these pot, get scarabs, scarabs! Gonna get the other scarabs, scarabs! Alright, let's head on down. Uh, oh, yeah, look look how far we're in this mine now. Oh! I thought you could just shield this because of the platform itself, or you could just roll. The music when it kicks in every time you're on these conveyor belts, like, just stay quiet and just, like, <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Dun, 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 gotta roll through his conveyor belt and ow! Hopefully, Belinda Tay made herself down here. Oh, I already know that she did. I'm just kind of being mysterious sometimes. Hello, you here? Belina, you made it. it! It hasn't been easy. Now, where is that spellstone? My father didn't say exactly where it was, but he knew that General Scales had hidden it somewhere close. Look carefully. I'm sure you and your little friend can find it before they do. Time is short. You must find the spellstone. And we will find it. Don't worry about it, Belinda Tay. We will find it. Look, there's a bunch of sharp claws everywhere. Just we're gonna just start fucking up sharp claws left and right down these mines. Get shit on. Oh yeah. Alright, you want some too, like your buddy over here? You didn't have a great time, and now you're not gonna have a great time. Ugh, get clubbed over there. Ow! That's not what I wanted to do. I didn't want to get clubbed. You were supposed to get clubbed. Get clubbed. Look, you see a bunch of them over there. Can I snipe them? Get fucked. <laughs> I hit them. Yeah. Can I use an object to, like, throw it at them? No, no, no. Pick that up. No! Pick it up. Throw it at them. Kobe! 
Ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, you fucker. <laughs> the scarab ran through. Trick it, go pick it up. We need to get all the scarabs. Oh, there it is. Thank you for bringing it to me. Fuck you, little dinosaur dude. Weird thing that grows out of the ground. So weird. I haven't taken up all the shark clothes because I don't want them roaming around thinking they own the place. You think I own the place? No, I own the place. These are my mines. You see that mine? You see that mushroom over there? Yeah, that mushroom is mine. Not that I particularly want a mushroom, but sure. Okay. Now this is probably the most difficult part of this entire goddamn uh, area. You had to bring up this this bomb over here, and you gotta climb. Oh god, you gotta make your way up here while avoiding these barrels. Cause if you get hit, you drop the bomb, and it's still all over. Ah, I gotta remember the path. Jeez. Uh, okay, go right. Go left. Uh, go left. Hook right. You can't see sometimes because it's a spiral. Uh, come on. Uh, oh. Don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit. Go, 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 go. Okay, good. Remember, you gotta really be careful. You don't wanna drop it, you don't wanna go over the edge and, you know, blow that shit up. You wanna make it here. And we're gonna put it down. Hiya. Okay. Now that it's down, we're gonna go around the side, go up this ladder. And there'll be a switch on top to activate this little. It's like a barrel mover thing. Um, a barrel transporter, if you will. It's gonna help us move that bomb up on top so then we can use it. Uh, across the head. This is the most tedious part of this, of this area, so you really have to be careful. So hopefully I can make this in one shot. Look, there it goes. Look, look at the little rock, dude. Yeah, suck it up. Alright, now bring it up. Come on. Come on. There it is. Yeah. Alright, pick it up. Now we gotta be careful with these fire flames. I don't want to get burned. Alright, go. It's best to wait than rush it. You don't want to fucking go and burn your shit. Alright, let's run on through. There we are. Yep. Yes, this. All that for this. To flip a fucking switch. To move what, you may ask? Move that. Now the drawbridge. Across where the barrels were shooting down. So let's head on down there and see what's up with that. Now, we did all that to open the bridge that will lead us to another switch to move those draw bridges right there so we can get on that cannon. Fuck me. <laughs> they really add a lot of stuff for you to do to do one little thing. Can I drop down here? No, drop down, drop down. Come on. No, Fox, drop down! Oh! Ah, fuck, that hurt. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, oh jeez. Okay, let's roll on through. Break this. They really just threw the crane here just for our health. Cause uh, I saw that rock. You thought you were slick. Am I faster than a rock? Oh, I can be. Ooh, I am. Okay, let's hurry up before the rock passes us. Get onto the switch and move that bridge. Yeah, that looks good. Awesome. Oh, you motherfucker, you scared the shit out of me. Let's gotta get on top. We gotta climb up, get to the cannon, and uh, use the cannon to break some shit open. So that we can then get out of this little mine. Now, Belinda Tate did say that the spellstone was near around here, so so we, sh we should be close. Da -da -da, climbing up the ladder again I Star Fox Fox McCloud Oh yeah, why am I singing up again? I ran out of things to say What, what, what are you, what are you uh, muggies thinking about this game so far? I really hope you guys are enjoying this let's play I, I know it's like a lot of people genuinely don't like this Oh, what the fuck, I'm going around Ow! A lot of people don't like this game because it's not Star Fox Gameplay, it's Zelda gameplay, but I fucking love it. I, I actually personally don't mind Fox fitting in a Zelda styled game as long as they make it, you know, plausible to work in a Star Fox universe like Dinosaur Planet. It's on a corner edge of the Lilat system, and if it blows up, it'll fuck up the entire thing. It's like, fuck yeah, that's awesome, right? Fox is usually known to be in ship, but what is he like on ground? You see him in Smash Brothers, so fuck it, why can't he do this? Awesome, we got this cannon. Oh, Kapuya! Ooh. Yep, let's bring up this rockety bridge. I don't know how shooting cannons at these panels really do that. It doesn't make any sense, but 
just go along with it. <laughs> oh man. That doesn't make any sense! It really doesn't make sense! Fuck! Alright, let's get on down. Alright, let's slide down this ladder. Whoops. Meant to deactivate that. I don't know why I had that activated. Alright, let's drop on down. <laughs> oh man, that really fucking sucks. Hey, but it only cost us two pieces of health. Like, that's really it, like half a bar? Like, it's not bad. Awesome. Alrighty. Let's, uh. We'll just call it out here for the end of this episode of Star Fox Adventures. In the next one, we'll see what's on the other side of this teleporter. And, uh,. As always, let me know what you guys think about this episode. What's your favorite part? And let me know if you guys, what, how you guys enjoying about this Star Fox Let's Play so far. Let me know what you guys think about it and what you guys, if you guys have seen this or you want, or you seen it already. If you want to see more, let me know down in the fucking comments below. I really want to hear what you guys got to say about this game and what you think about it. And as always, I'll see all you beautiful muggies in the next one. Bye-bye.